record this. Yeah, thank you for telling me that. <laughs> Just, <laughs> oh, good morning. Welcome, everybody. This is Janet Legere with our CLB Learning Webinar. We have a great call in the store for you guys today. I'm just going to get back set up here. Wow, everybody popped in here while I was trying to fix everything. So it's good to see everybody here. Welcome, welcome. All right. We have a great call in store for you today. We had a little break. We were off for a few weeks. Quite enjoyed it. I got to say that, although... I'll tell you, it was a pretty busy few weeks with all the grandkids, but we loved every minute of it. And glad to be back here with you guys. I've got a 10-week session set up where we're going to go through everything that's part of CLB. And today, it's the system and the setup. So we're going to go ahead and get started. We're going to go through the back office of CLB Learning. I'm going to show you where everything is, how you get started, really show you how simple CLB Learning can be, because it really is simple. It uh, doesn't need to be complicated. There's not a lot of stuff back there to distract you. But again, there's still stuff back there to distract you. So I'm going to show you how to go through there, make sure that you're on task and getting things done. It really is as simple as we say it is. So let me go into desktop sharing. And that was see, this is all different. I've got a different Zoom. So everything is different now. <laughs> But I can see that we're logged in. So, so here we are at our desktop. This is the CLB Learning Members area. I am actually going to log in here as a free member so that you can see the difference. So here as a free member, you'll see that it meets you with an upgrade notice. And we're going to work on this. Chris and I are working together. Just so you guys know, Chris has been partnering up with me and doing some great things in the background. And we got lots of great things coming for you guys. And one of the things is we're going to update this upgrade page because the price is going up. We offer so much value here at CLB Learning that we just figure the $97 is a steal in my mind. So uh, we're going to be adding some things to this. So this explains to you what you get with your lifetime membership. You get upgrades in our viral mailers. You're going to earn 50% commission. You get our CLB blogging platform. That is a pretty incredible incentive right there. You get some personal consultation with yours truly access to our telegram group the quick start guide that's in our back office is branded with all of your details so you can give that away we even show you how to set up a funnel to do that you're going to get upgrades in our four viral mailers along with here it says twenty five thousand credits but i actually give you fifty thousand credits so that lets you email for quite some time before you're going to have to earn credits one thing that's not on the upgrade page is that once you upgrade and get your um your system set up when you have your capture page and your funnel all set up, I'm going to add you to our team rotator where your capture page is going to rotate with other CLB members in all of our advertising. And that's going to bring uh, leads and members to you without too much effort on your part. All we ask is that you help out with some of the advertising done for you set up. That means Yep, done for you. I will set up your whole system for you, provided you are upgraded at LeadSleep. That's all you have to be done, be uh, upgraded there. And I will set your whole system up. And then you're ready to go into the rotator. So $97 is the one-time price at the moment. That will be going up. Um, I'm not sure if it'll go up September 1st, but it's going to be going up very, very quickly. So watch out for that. Maybe contact your downline if you're already an upgraded member and let them know price is going up, they might want to take advantage of that while they can. As a free member, under the download section, under the down, oh, here we are, here's our downloads, you have the quick start guide, which is not branded to you, which means the details in the quick start guide just go to the main site. You get access to the resolution success system, abundant thinking, rich dad mindset. There's a couple of uh, ebooks in there. How to succeed quotes. There's the email series for your autoresponder. So if you're using a different autoresponder or you're a free member, we do have some emails and we have some follow up text. So those are available for you to download. You have access to the funnel set up here, which shows you everything you need to set up your CLB funnel. We're going to be going through that in the other page. Uh, here is your live training and events. So here is where you can register for our weekly webinars, which is every Wednesday at noon Eastern. And if you're looking for the replays, they're right here on our YouTube channel. And make sure when you go to our YouTube channel, it will come up eventually. <laughs> 
Here's our playlists. So you'll see there's all the replays from our webinars are here and make sure that you subscribe to our channel uh, when you get here. So I'm already subscribed, so it's not showing the subscribe button. All right, so that's it as a free member. So I'm just gonna log out here and I'm gonna log in as an upgraded member. And you'll notice that I'm not presented with the upgrade notice anymore. I just come into the main page where it describes everything you need. now. I don't want you to get confused. There's not a lot on the main page here. There's a few menu items on the left-hand side. Live training and events. We saw that as a free member. Training replays. Here we have your CLB funnel setup. And down here, upgraded membership bonuses. And this is where you can set up to get your CLB blogging platform. If we click on that, you'll see that right here, the CLB blogging platform. And here's where you register to get your, your blog. Now, what I also need to put in here is uh, I don't have instructions on how to get the upgrades in the viral mailers. Uh, you have to ask for those upgrades. So once you are a member, you can just email support and ask me to upgrade you in all four of those mailers. All right, so let's go back to the home page. It walks you down here on uh, joining our Telegram group, joining our Facebook group, liking our Facebook page, subscribing to our YouTube channel, and then setting up your CLB funnel. Do you see how there's not a lot to confuse you here? There's no advertising in the back office, nothing like that. I like to keep it really simple, okay? So the first thing you wanna do when you come into CLB Learning as a new member is become familiar with the members area. That is so important in any program you belong to. And the reason for that is so that you know where to find things. Because believe me, I don't know the answer to everything, but I know where to find things. I know where to look. I know where to go and look for things. So you need to become familiar. So you have your homepage, which goes through everything here, talks about uh, our, our programs and how to get set up. You can set up your profile, make sure you put your address and make sure you put your WISE email address. If you don't have a WISE account, you just go to WISE.com. It's free to set up an account there, attach it to your bank account, and then I can pay you your commissions to your email account. The affiliate toolbox has quite a bit of information here. Again, you could get distracted, but don't allow yourself, okay? Here's where you're gonna find your referrals. So if you click on that, it gives you all the information about your referrals. Uh, where you can contact them. It's got their email, their phone number. Uh, when they've logged in, you can get your commissions. So this explains your commissions and how to request them. We have our downline builder. This is an important area because these are the programs that are a part of CLB Learning. Now, the programs that are back here are either to help you get traffic to your website, set up your funnel, or help you get leads. That's, that's all there is. Now, the first item you're going to see here it says your primary business. People get confused with this one because there's no banner there, right? But this is where you put the link to your business. So if you have a network marketing business or an affiliate program that you want to build, you can put that link in here. Now it does say, do not include HTTP. Okay. So all you do is put the URL minus that. Right. And if you want to check your sponsor's primary business, you client, it says to sign up, click here. When you click on that, it's going to take you to your sponsor's primary business. And let's move down. We've got Udemy solo ads. Again, you, you're going to click here to sign up and come back and put your ID here and make sure it's the ID that Udemy gives you. It's the what's at the end of your affiliate link. People get confused with the downline builder and sometimes they put the whole URL in here. Sometimes they put a username so they're not really paying attention to what they need to put in here. So make sure you're putting the right information. Otherwise, when you sponsor new people to CLB Learning, they're not going to see your URLs. And that's really how this all works, right? As you build your funnel, as you get subscribers, as you get new members, the new members are going to do what you did. They're going to set up their funnel. They're going to advertise their funnel. And when they do that, they're going to come here to sign up in those programs, right? So you want to make sure that you have your information here so that when people join you in CLB Learning, they're going to join the programs in the downline builder under you. And you know what happens then when they upgrade, you're going to earn a commission. So you can, they might upgrade in your primary business. They might upgrade in any of our mailers. They might send a solo ad in Udemy. If they you know, purchase and send a solo ad in Udemy, you'll earn a commission. 
Um, if they download WOW app and set you up, you can be earning commissions there. So everywhere you look, you could be earning commissions, right? Savings Highway Global is a free savings program. So you can sign up for that. And there's some ways for you as a free member to, to save some money, to earn some credits and with their little apps that they have. And Jetstream Traffic is our new partner, Chris's um, viral mailer. So you want to make sure that you sign up for all of those. Okay, so all of these programs are free to join other than your primary business that may or may not be free to join. Um, but the other programs here are free to join. The upgrades are optional. All right. And at Udemy, there is no upgrade. It's a free affiliate program. You simply go in and look at the solo ad providers and you can purchase a solo ad. And when you sponsor someone, if they purchase a solo ad, you'll earn a commission. So those are our programs. You want to make sure that you have your IDs in there. We've already looked at the download section, but you'll notice as an upgrade member, there are a few more um, upgrades. We have the Think and Grow Rich package. Um, there's a few others, As a Man Thinketh, I believe. And you see how there's a little star here? Whoops, on the quick start guide. That means that if I download this report, when I download it, it's going to put all of the IDs from the downline builder into the report because the report walks a member through how to set up their funnel. It goes through everything there and it has all the links to the programs in the report, all the mailers and everything like that. So they can just join it right from there. And if you're an upgraded member, those links will be all tag targeted to you. And uh, there we go. And that's your back office. So that's everything there. And like I said, it's a really good idea for you to become familiar with your back office. There's one more item here that is not available for free members, and that is the downline mailer. So if you are an upgraded member, you can come in here and send an email to your downline anytime. Now, just be forewarned that I get a copy of all the emails. I see the emails, so I will be reading them and watching them. We do encourage you not to spam your members. It's really about reaching out and connecting with them and encouraging them to get involved, encouraging them to connect with you. That's really what it's about, okay? Of course, inviting them to the webinars is another way to use the downline mail there. All right, so let's go back home. We've gone through the back office. It's just past quarter after the hour. We're going to get into setting up our funnel. And you guys are going to be shocked at how quick this is. Okay. So let's go over here. There are two ways to get you to your funnel set up. You'll see that it's right here on the menu. It's also at the bottom of the page. Start your CLB funnel setup here. So let's go here. CLB funnel setup. It says, welcome to the setup. And then we explain what you're going to do. You're going to set up your autoresponder, your capture page, your landing page, you're going to edit all those, and you're going to send traffic to your capture page. Bing, bada, boom. That's it. Did you get that? Okay, this isn't hard. You're going to set up an autoresponder campaign. We give you the codes. We give you everything to do that. You're going to set up the capture page and landing page. Again, we give you the codes to do that. Now, I do have to say something. You need to be an upgraded member in LeadSleep to make this work properly. You can do it as a free member. As a free member, the autoresponder is limited. You cannot set up a series of emails. You can only set up a welcome email. You might think, well, that's kind of useless, but it's not because as you start building your list, even as a free member, you can send a broadcast email to your list. So you can still connect, connect and communicate with that list, even as a free member. However, if you're joining for the first time with LeadSleep, it's like 19, it's under $20, $19.90 a month for an unlimited autoresponder. And if you miss the one-time upgrade, it's only $27 a month for an unlimited autoresponder. I don't know that there's an autoresponder out there that's more affordable, that works as well as Lead Sleep, okay? So it really is, I'm quite impressed with it. Uh, we do some training on Lead Sleep. There's a lot more to Lead Sleep than just your funnel, okay? So just gotta <laughs> forewarn you that once you get into Lead Sleep, it's important that you don't get distracted. So we're going to get in there and you'll see what I mean in a moment. So we come down here, it tells you how it works. And here we go. And now we're going to start with step one, setting up our funnel. So the first thing you need to do is join LeadSleep. So we're going to click on here. This link is connected to your sponsor, provided your sponsor has put their ID number in the downline builder. So we're going to click on that. It's going to open in a new window and you can sign up for free. Remember, it's a free membership. And when you sign up, you will get the offer to upgrade at for a lifetime member. Um, I mean, a monthly member. 
pro member. Okay. So I'm already a member. I'm going to log in. So here we are at our dashboard. I am um, an upgraded member. They've got some really cool upgrades that they did updates to the send steed autoresponder. You can now move people to other lists. You can, you know, um, sort them based on their activity. It's actually pretty cool. I'm not going to go through everything here in the back office of Lee Sleep. As you can see, there's an awful lot. One thing you have to be forewarned about is all the advertising. So you see down here, these are all members ads. These are all members ads. You'll earn credits for clicking those ads and your ad can get shown here as well. Now we do a full training on Lead Sleep showing you all of that. So we'll get into that at another time. Today, we are simply focused on setting up your CLB funnel, which is what you want to do when you're just getting started. You don't want to come in here and go through everything in lead sleep, okay? You want to come in here and set up your funnel, get that going, start advertising your funnel, get everything working properly. Then you can come back to lead sleep and learn about everything there is here for you to get more traffic to your website because that's what lead sleep is all about. All right, it really is about getting more traffic to your website and um, the pro ads are pretty incredible. So we're going to come down here and get started. The first thing we want to do is set up our campaign for our list. So we're going to click on list manager and we're going to add a new list. All right. So we're going to call it CLB learning. Maybe I'll just put contacts. I already have leads. All right. Add new. So there we go. Now we've set up our campaign. There's a lot more to do yet. All right, so we're going to click on the settings here. So you just activate this list. So we're going to click on the settings. Now, this is the part that maybe seem a little bit complicated, okay? Um, we're not we're not going to put a brand in here. You can if you want to. I do on my main CLB page. I've got a logo here. Um, here it says show a link after verification right here. We're going to come back here and put your landing page in here, okay? So that we're going to create a landing page where your subscriber goes after they fill out their name and email address. So we're going to put that here when we're done. Opt out from these lists after verification. So this is something new and that's that's a little bit different. We've got somebody that is not muted. Brooks Fields, we're just going to mute you. There we go. All right, so we're going to come back over to here. Now, here are my details and I have to enter all of my information and you need your address and everything. So I'm just going to, it's going to be my Google. So I'll accept it. You'll notice that it put my email address. Okay. So whatever email address you put in here, I recommend you use the same email address that you're registered with in Leadsleep. And I'll show you why. Because here, see email verification codes. You have to verify your email for the autoresponder, right? So it's going to create a code unless you use your registered email address. So I'm going to click send a code and see it says auto verified because this email is your account email. So we say okay and we're good. Now we're going to come down here and we're going to create a signature file. So a signature file is simply your signature. You're going to have your name, your contact information, and hopefully your picture. So I am going to choose to have my signature file go in any email that I create. So when I create a broadcast email, I don't need to put a signature. When I write my follow-up emails, I don't need to put a signature. And when I write in the email series, I don't need to put a signature. But I do need to create my signature. So I'm going to put my name and my contact information. Now I went and I put my contact information into a file. So I didn't have to type it again, okay? So that's a good idea for you to do. So I have my text, phone, WhatsApp is my phone number, Telegram, Skype, Facebook Messenger, Wow app is all the same username. Highly recommend you do the same, that you keep your usernames consistent. It makes it much easier. Now I would like to put a picture in here. I already have a picture uploaded, but you wouldn't. So we're going to update this and come back. And I'm going to save this without activating. Okay, I'm not going to activate this just yet because I want to upload a picture and I'm going to need um, the link for the redirect. All right. So the next thing we're going to do is we are going to create our emails. We're going to come back to this to update our, 
our um, list. All right, so here is our emails. I want to add import. Okay, so I'm gonna click import and it wants a share code. So this is where I'm gonna come back to CLB Learning. See, I can have two windows open. And here are all my share codes. So this is the first one I need for my emails. Oh, come here, you. You have to make sure that you have that code just as it is, all right? You don't need a space before or after. So I'm over to my list. I'm gonna enter that code. I'm gonna to say to replace. You do have to fill those in. Import now and boom. Look at that. We have seven, eight emails set up. Now, the next thing you're gonna to need to do is edit these emails. So you're gonna click on edit and you'll notice that it has a link in here. You're gonna click that link. You see how it brings up the edit link feature? And we're gonna change that. So you would have to put your CLB ID number there. All right, my ID is eight. If it was different, I would you know, change it to 23, which is Dawn's. Okay. And then you say, okay, and that saves it. You come down here. Now you'll see, this is something that's gonna be a little advanced. I'm gonna have, you have to make sure that you have all the links in here. So you gotta change that, right, to your ID and then save. But because of the way this email is, because there's a PS, I'm going to put my signature file in here. All right, so that it puts the signature between the PS and CLB Learning. All right, I'm gonna come down here to the very bottom and we're gonna save it. Okay, and there we go. So that first email is now saved. Oops. And it will show you, all right, see there, it put my signature file right where I wanted it. Now, if I don't, you'll see in the next email, there is no signature file. Well, I mean, there's no PS. We'll go to the second one because we have to edit all of these. Highly recommend that you get a notebook out and write down one through eight and then check them off as you're done so that you know which emails you have completed. Now, I'm not going to do all of these. We'll do a couple. So you come down here and you're going to scroll down the body of the email and you're going to click on the link that's hyperlinked and you're going to edit it. You're going to find the number on the end and you're going to replace that with your CLB ID number. And you're going to come down here. Now you'll see sincerely CLB learning is kind of a space there. Let's just fix that. I'm not going to put a signature file in here because it will do it. All right. So I've changed that. Now I'm going to come down here and save. And it's going to show us the email and there's my signature. Okay. Isn't that cool? So you want to do that for all eight emails. All right. So I've done it for two. You're going to do it for the rest of them. Now we're going to come back over here to image manager down on the side because we need to add an image to our signature. And you're going to, this is where you can upload an image to Leadsly. And you can only do this if you're an upgraded member. All right, another reason to upgrade. So I'm going to click add new image. And I'm going to go on to my computer. Let's see if I can find a picture here. And you'll just find a picture that you want to upload. Here we go. We'll try that one. And there's my picture. Okay. And so now... I can close that. I can come back to my list manager, to my settings right here. And this is good because it's good for you to go back and forth and be comfortable with the program, okay? None of this is hard. We're gonna coming down here to our signature, right here, we're gonna edit it. Now I'm gonna put a space. Let's see here, I wanna go to image. Here I could insert a picture from a file. I can show you how to do that as well, or I can go to my image gallery and I'm gonna grab this picture and say, okay, now I need to make it smaller. There we go. And there's my picture. Now I can update it. And now my, my emails will all have that picture in it. So I'm not gonna activate this yet. I'm gonna save without activating because we still need to put our landing page link in here. So that's the next thing we're gonna do. 
We've created our list. Now we're going to come down here to Page Manager. And click on Page Manager. We're going to add a new page. And we're going to call it our CLB Lander. I'm going to call it Lander so it's different than what I already have there. I'm going to add now. So once you add it, nothing is really happening. We have to click Add a New Page Design to Start. And this is where we can use our share code. So we're going to come back over to here. And this is the landing page. And we're making the landing page first because the landing page gets attached to the capture page. So we need the landing page for when we're creating the capture page. So we're going to enter that in here. And the landing page has more edits than the capture page. So it, as well, takes a little longer. So here's our page. We're going to come here. We're going to launch editor, right? Pretty simple so far. Just click, click, right? All right, so here we are. Now there's a few things. We'll start here with our picture. So you see when I put my mouse over the picture, it kind of highlights it. If I click on it, it brings everything up here. So I could go here and I could enter this picture. All right, you see how it puts a different picture. I have it centered um, and there we go. So we can keep it that picture or I could put a different picture. I could go, let's say I can go over here to Facebook to my profile, right? Here's my profile picture. I could go, whoops. I, <laughs> All right, it's, it's showing me on here. I didn't want to, um, all right, for some reason, it's not letting me go. All right, I'm going to go back to Facebook. All right, so I want to, there we go, choose my profile picture. <laughs> anyway, but I can go to my pictures here and I can right click on my picture. I'm going to shut my Facebook off. Uh, you can choose your, you can go to your profile picture on Facebook and you can right click on your profile picture and get the image URL. And then you could use that picture here if you don't have a picture to upload, just telling you. But if you're a pro member, much easier to come in and just upload a picture. All right, then we can close that. So the picture's done. We're going to change some text. So here it says, hello, my name is Janet Legere. So you're not Janet Legere. <laughs> So you're going to come here and see when you click the box, it brings up a new box to edit. And you're going to come over here and see there's my name. I can make this bigger. Whoops. I didn't want to do that. All right. My name is. Right. And you're going to put your name here. And right here, click here to grab your free system. Remember how in the email we had to change that? So you see, we click the box, brings up a new window. And here's the URL. So here's the URL. You're going to go right to the end of the URL where there is a number. This is awfully small. Let me see if I can make There we go. Right. And we're going to change that number. And then once you change that number, you're going to scroll down here to the bottom of the page. Start now for free. See how I click on that? Brings it up. You're going to put your mouse on the URL and go to the end. Just push the end button. And then you're going to find that number. You're going to backspace that number out of there and put your number in there. And down at the very bottom of the page is another box. When you click on that, you see it brings it up on the right-hand side. So you're going to put your name right, right there. So you just change it over here on the right-hand side. Change your phone number, your contact details, and that's it. Okay? So let's just go back. We've changed our name and our contact information. Start now for free. We changed the URL. Click here to grab your free system. We changed the URL. My name is Janet Legere. We change it to your name and we change the picture to yours. And then once you're done, you're going to click save. All right, there we go. We can close that page now. We're going to come back to the page manager and go up to the top and we're going to add a new page and we're going to call this CLB capture page. I'm just going to call it capture. All right, so here's our capture page. Again, we have to add a new page. We're going to get the share code right here. Here's the share code for our capture page. 
import it and there it is so now we're going to edit the page so we're going to launch the editor this one has far less to do all right you're going to love this now there are i haven't changed the main page yet and here's one thing you may want to do that i did on my personal page right here where it says put more money in your pocket janet Major invites you to put more money in your pocket and see how it's spaced here. I can get rid of that space. There we go. All right. You can do that. Put your name on there. Really good idea. I noticed that once I put my name on there, it really changed the opt-in rate. Then you come over here to your list. All right. We want to be send steed. We need to get our list. All right. It'll come up blank for you. Here's our new one. CLB learning contacts. I'm just going to click on that. Now here I want it to redirect the URL. So I'm going to get the page, right? Get page. And here's the page I just created. I want to use this. I want the pro page. Use this. And there it is. And that's it. I can save it. And we're done. Now the only other thing we need to do now is come back to our list manager, to our CLB contacts. And we're going to click on this and here right show link after verification whoops should have left it open i just opened this in a new window to get where's my page man there it is all right then down here to our lander here's our clb landing page i'm going to copy that link and come back over to our list and i want to add my landing page right there okay and then we're gonna come down here now because we're done, whoops, I went too far. And we're gonna save and activate. By activating, we agree that we've entered our postal address. We're not sending spam or pyramid schemes or anything like that. Save and activate, there we go. So that is activated. We're gonna move over here to our page manager. CLB capture page. We're gonna click on that. Look at this beautiful page. One more thing left to do. And that is to test the page. All right, we're going to click. Now it should redirect me to my landing page, and it did. All right, now it does come up and say you need to activate your email address, which is awesome. But when I click that, it brings me up to my landing page that I just created. And so someone can come here and get started right away. Now you want to make sure, uh oh, see, this is good. One thing I forgot to do on my list manager. You know, there's always something. We're going to come over to our settings. Right down here. Email me. Yes. So now this is something new as well with SendSteed. Email after opt-in verified. Email before opt-in verified. So you can have that either way. What this means, not everyone verifies their email. And you can get lots of um, notifications that you have a new subscriber. So there's two ways to look at that. If they have not verified their email, you can certainly follow up with them personally, uh, or you can just get emails of people who have verified their email address. Those are the active ones. So it's up to you. I'm going to say for all of them, it says you'll receive a lot of emails, which is really kind of funny. That's what I want, right? And we'll save and activate that. And now I'm going to come back over to here, one of these pages. All right, and I'm going to refresh this page because I changed my campaign, right? And because I want it to come to my inbox. So I'm going to show you. I have to learn to type. Kind of small, I can't really see it. There we go. All right, so we opted in again, and now when I come over here, I should, there we go. Someone has opted into your list, and here is my activation email. All right, so I know things are working. I'm going to click on that, and I'm going to activate my email, and boom. So now, watch this. Now I'm going to get notification, right? So see, I know someone has opted in. There you go. Thank you for subscribing. So now I know my emails are working. Let's click on it. There we go. There's my email. I can join CLB Learning here. 
has my signature and everything is right there. How cool is that? So there's only one thing left to do now. We've set up our capture page, our landing page, our autoresponder. Now we need to get traffic. And that is next week's webinar. And all you need to know for getting traffic is you need this website, your capture page. And that's where you're going to send traffic to. You're going to use the, the um, viral mailers like we teach you to use. You can use Udemy solo ads. You can go into Traffic Least Income and get part of a co-op. There's lots of ways to get traffic to your website. We'll be talking about that next week. But I'm going to come back into the room. I'm going to turn off desktop sharing. Here we go. There we go. Come back into the room and see if anybody has any questions. You guys are uh, welcome to unmute yourselves. That would be awesome. And see if there's any questions. Did that make sense? Did you guys see how simple that really is? It doesn't yes. really take a lot to set this up. It's not, you know, you don't need to be an experienced computer user even. Just follow the steps. Just follow what we show you how to do and don't get distracted, right? You just got to go, watch the video, pause it, do what we said, and it all works out. Any questions? And look, it, that took 20 minutes. How cool is that? With all the explanation, it still only took 20 minutes to set up the entire funnel. I think that's pretty cool. Any questions? No. No, I, I guess I did an okay job then. Yeah. <laughs> right? You did an awesome job. So yeah. remember, guys, if you're an upgraded member, you can get part of our, our team rotator. Just get in touch with me and we can talk about how to get that set up. I just need your capture page. If you're an upgraded member and you haven't set up your funnel yet, contact me. I'd be happy to set that up for you. Let's get things going. Let's get action happening. I got to tell you that the rotator has uh, created a lot of activity. Uh, we're seeing signups every day coming in through there. So it's uh, pretty exciting and we want you to be a part of that. CLB is the place to be because we're simple. We get you started building your list, which is the most important thing to be doing here online. If you want to make, make money, if you want to sponsor people into your network marketing business, you need to have a list of prospects. You need to have a list of people who are following what you're doing. So that's what we're teaching here. Keeping it simple. You guys have been awesome. That's it for me. If, unless you have any questions or want me to show you anything else, Anything? I, um, <clears throat> just uh, just make that, that little announcement that I told you about before as far as uh, jet steering traffic. For, for anyone that upgrades the CLB, they also get an upgrade at right. jet stream traffic. I will have to add that to our upgraded list. So there you go, guys. If you uh, didn't hear that, Chris is very generously offering anybody who upgrades at CLB also gets an upgrade great in her jet stream traffic which i gotta tell you guys it is a new viral mailer but i get activity from there with almost every mailing yeah, I so it. i mean it's uh that's it's a about new mailers hey janet this is vicky i'd gladly do that too with any one of my sites of their choice excellent okay well that's awesome i will add that to uh to our list and they could just, I'll just have them that they contact you personally, right? That sounds good. All right, you guys are awesome and I appreciate that. I appreciate your involvement. I appreciate your activity. I just appreciate all of you. You're like family to me. You know that, right? You've been, some of you have been around with me for a long time. With CLB <laughs> Learning has been here since 2003. That's a long time. <laughs> that's a long time, so. You're telling how old we are. <laughs> yeah, no, shh. No, we have an age. That's the beauty of the internet. Nobody ever changes. You see, we still see. <laughs> anyway, we'll be back next week talking about traffic and tracking, and uh, we'll get some activity happening for all of you guys. In the meantime, you have all week. If you need any help getting your system set up, you know where to find me, right? Grab me on Telegram. You've got all my contact information. I'm always available. You guys are awesome. I love you. We'll see you next week. Have a great week, everyone. Bye-bye. Bye, everyone. Bye.